Wait, Mr. Allen. Wait, you can't. Mr. Doublecross, I think you have to look at this right away. Well, Mr. Allen, I'm on a call, but why don't you just come in? I feel this is urgent enough to warrant your immediate attention. All right, please have a seat first. This is the third time I've talked about this with you. There are now more than 80,000 confirmed SAD cases on Trappist-G, and the number is still rising. Mr. Allen, I have said this to you before. There is no evidence suggesting that SAD has any connection with Earthlings. Just read on and you'll see. What we found in the 600 patient samples we've tested is that there are traces of oxygen. This suggests the common factor that they all share is having previously traveled to Earth. But there is no related records in our medical facilities. Humans have never contracted SAD. The cause and modes of transmission mentioned in the report, well, are quite unclear at this stage. Automation. According to our analysis, the level of automation on Earth is significantly higher than that of our planet. The electrons in machines, when collided, release electromagnetic radiation that affects the beta neuron on the peripheral nerve. And this makes trapeze slothful. <laughs> in fact, I don't see the problem. This is pure nonsense. Isn't this obvious? This is all caused by automation on Earth. The trapeze who have been to Earth don't want to work or socialize anymore. And some don't even want to cook. Last week, Trappist G Interstellar Customs even discovered some smuggled cooking robots. <laughs> no. We must terminate the Trappist G Alien Travel Convention. I'm afraid you don't have the right to do that. Only the Prime Minister of Trappist G can put an end to the convention. I have brought with me the authorization to terminate. And there was me thinking you were a highly civilized race from whom we could learn. But I'm disappointed about the arrogance and lack of responsibility. Look what 12 years of automation has turned you into. Okay, okay. Please calm down, Mr. Allen. I apologize for the situation. But I believe we need more research and data analysis on that. I understand the situation is dire, but there must be a better solution. We hope the pandemic will not affect the relationship between Travis and Earth. I couldn't possibly envisage any better solution. Considering the limited knowledge Traps G has of Saad, we would like to offer all Trappies access to the latest medical robots to conduct a more comprehensive research. From what we've seen on Earth, nothing can stop Saad. You see, we have many years of experience treating stress-related disorders, and we are quite confident that the technology is cutting edge. This is a fully automated Saad of treatment. All you need to do is just inject a chip into the patient's body, and this emits an anti-wave signal which stabilizes the patient. And don't worry, this is absolutely safe. Well, to show our solidarity, we will offer this technology free of charge. Please do have a look at this proposal. Hmm, well, let's hope it works but I'll have to take this proposal back for further consideration. Certainly. I look forward to hearing from you soon. Do take care of yourself, Mr. Double Cross. You too, Ambassador. Sorry. Please forgive me, Mr. Double Cross. I... I don't really understand the support that we are committing. Does that mean we have to invest some more resources on this trapeze? We came, we saw, we automated. <laughs>